This is Billy Ruth Hopkins Futurici on KCIW 100.7 on your FM dial, right here in beautiful downtown Brookings, where almost every day is a beautiful day and we can always choose to say yes. Life is indeed very, very good. Well, you may remember that this is a work of pure, unadulterated allegorical fiction, or what J.R.R. Tolkien liked to call feigned history. So, sit back, relax, suspend all disbelief, and let's continue with our tale. finding themselves in a dream of the distant future. Angela and Ethergis discover millions of shattered shards on the deck of the lost mother ship Athandra. Grandma Gaga's brother, Elijah Lightwing, is the future captain of the lost mother ship, wandering through deep space, playing his ethereal music of the spheres. They discover bits and pieces of broken PCRTDs, personal communication recording and transportation devices, that have become the forest fairies on the planet of Aetherius. Oh, check it out, dear listeners, we have right here before our very eyes an exterior shot of the huge, badly damaged mothership of thunder as it warps and creeps through space in the distance like a lost baby whale singing a mournful song. Let's keep listening as Captain Lightwing's exploration craft discovers it. Look! There in the distance, it must be the mothership at Andra that escaped from Earth just before the solar tsunami of 4332. We are approaching her now. Look at that jagged hole in the edge of an open bay. It's been ripped apart by an asteroid or some alien enemy ship. Look! There's the ancient insignia, Athondra. Ooh, she is stunning, crew, just look. Retro engines, pilot, let's ease us on down. Ooh, let's listen and watch as Captain Lightwing shuttle rocks gently down onto the wide, badly damaged deck of the mothership Athondra as they open the hatch and carefully step down the long gangplank. Angela, Thurgis, and Captain Lightwing seem to be merging as one as they enter the dome control room, which was blown wide open like a gash in their very heart. Something devastating happened last century. Hmm, listen to those million shattered crystalline orbs strewn around like confetti. They're humming, speaking to us, chirping, as if alive. Angela, pick up that dark blue curved shard. You can see your own reflection. Oh, dear listeners, as Angela holds up the dark shard. She sees multiple images of her own eyes beating with the eyes of thousands reflecting back. A thousand voices crying, Captain Angelo Ethergis, do not abandon Angelita. No century that a few we still blaze luminous light, brilliant and compassionate. Do not abandon. We Zergo. are the galactic we glories lost for of untimely times. We declare light as light wave song in ultraviolet voids of black space and forgiveness. Love, spirit, reach for truth. Light, breathe, and grow from the evolved. It is their fruit. Now it is time. 
swirling be the light, stars, living dreams unearthed from the depths. It is time to grasp hold of gravity. Oh, Mother of Thunder, I can clearly see Angela as she dreams, becoming a composite of Captain Leetwing, Wisteria, and Grandma Gaga. Look, she is middle-aged now, stepping out from the choir of voices, hovering over the ancient decaying mothership. Lovingly, she cradles a virgins in her arms as they scan the gallery of shattered orbs. Suddenly she stops in stark recognition. It surges. Well, hey, we've been here before. Wait, what? Huh. We, we better go rescue Angelita and save Earth from final destruction in that solar tsunami. Yeah, Angela, why do you think I'm writing this thing now? Hush. My muse speaks. Well, this has got to be a dream. What, what, what are you writing, Ethurgis? Yeah, it's my musical version of Angelita and Shabono, of course. Oh, you mean, you mean the one Mrs. Dalloway and Senor Ruel produced at Crestone Charter School? Yeah, precisamente, Angela. Oh, well, yeah, my Spanish is much better than Jennifer's, and I should have been playing that part of Angelita instead of Jennifer. Oh, if all, Angela. Huh, what did you say, Thurgis? Yeah, that wasn't me, Angela. Yeah, but time to evolve. Okay, everyone, let's get going. Careful with these broken PCRTD orbs. They hold all the answers here, my friends. They were for instantaneous transportation through wormholes. Let's see if they still work. Ooh, listen gasps from the crew. Echo throughout the circular chamber as they are dissolved at hyperspace speed, disintegrated, crystallized, then are drawn slowly to a huge magenta eye in the center of swirling luminescent light stumbling through a wormhole. Oh, oh, Thurgis, this, this is what it looked like when, when we went through that crystalline cave in Mount Shivano. Are, are we still dreaming, or is this a part of your musical? Ah, oh, meow, pudiera ser ambos, Angelita. Uh, I'm Angela, not Angelita. Well, what's the difference? Remember what Mrs. Dalloway always said? What is a dream? What is reality? Remember all those tiny people with crystals growing out of the tops of their heads and their ears and their legs? Oh, right, little crystal people, I remember that. But, but, but that was a dream. It's happening again. We're being loaded onto these mining carts on tracks, just like they did with us in the in that dream. Where are they taking us, Ethurgis? Yeah, hang on, Angela. You're you're getting ahead of me. We're we're going to Ethurgis through caves under that waterfall down the river of Let Go. Oh, oh, oh my orb! We're we're tumbling like roller coasters, landing on the banks of the great pine forest. Meow, caray, mire, Angelita. Shattered shards are becoming millions of forest fairies, fluttering their wings, waking us up. I'm Angela, not Angelita. What's the difference, meow? Get a century, Angela. We're on Ethereus. As millions of shattered PCRTD crystalline orbs, we are on Ethereus. As millions of shattered PCRTD crystal norms, we contain all knowledge and Angela. historical records from As all time of and space. PCRTD Some of us norms. never made it. Some of to us never and made are it still to mining Ethereus. crystals and are down still there mining in crystals the caves of Mount down there in the caves of down Mount there in the caves of Mount Shavano. Oh. So that's where all those little crystalline people came from. Oh, of course, but let's cut to my TV studio in the dark matter domain. Oh, here I, I will be the director. 
But, Pop, Pop, you said I could be the director. Hello, if I changed my mind. Now, quiet on the set. Quiet, I say. Focus on Mount Shivano. There, good. Get a close up there. Yes, good. Now, slowly bring up the sound. Angel, one go. Mysterio, wake up. Stop dreaming and get on stage. There, right there, down the stage, right. Help them with their golden hooded robes, doll. Good, yes. Now, ladies, you must begin to swing. Bow and fall when the music starts. Slowly, like you are on a sailing ship. Move in rhythm to the waves and the wind. Etheria, it's time for your ethereal choir. Oh, Ethergis of the three phase fountain of the three praise mountain, show us thy way. Open your eyes, wake up. Fíjense que se abren los ojos nuevos. Pay attention. We are one. Take time to listen. Time to be still. Time to see who you truly are. Become who you truly are. Abrense los ojos nuevos. Open new eyes unto the world. We are the fountain of new life. Happiness and peace. We are the well spring well new life, new life, fresh water, fresh water, clean air, clean air. Escuchen, despierten, se abrense los ojos nuevos, a fijar en un mundo nuevo. Get in touch, get in touch. Open new eyes unto the world. It is time, it is time to, get to get in touch with your inner self. self. The blueprint, the blueprint of, the of the best you can be. be. Ahora es el tiempo de llegar a ser lo que Become who you truly are. Be who you truly are. Trust your heart, Trust your heart. anchoring you anchoring to your highest, to good. Your highest good. good. Be not subject, Be not subject to, to shifting it. sands of circumstance. No seas sueto a los vientos de circunstancias, los vientos ventisqueros. Si no sigue con gozo, amor y fe, go forth with joy, love, and faith. We are the three phase mountains of, of, of the three praise mountains springing forth springing from, from the universal, the oversoul. Oversoul. Okay, but now you can take over here as the assistant director. Yeah, get some clothes on, girl, and, and pick up that bowhole. Get all those actors ready. Okay, there you go. Oh, okay. All right. Thank you, Pop. Okay, come on, you three. Come on out here. It's time. Get a move on. Get a move on. Let's go. Hurry up there. Up, up, up. Up, up, up. Okay, Pop. Okay, they got it. Oh, good. Good. They've got it. I watched that. Oh, there they go, swaying back and forth. <gasps> okay, quiet on the set. And uh, action. Well, my poor butt. I don't get it at all. What is this, anyway? Well, honey, they told me I'd be shooting a cat food commercial. Uh, that's what they told me in that other dream, but that was the other dream, Mom. You know what this one is. I, and I've got to go get my choir ready. My ethereal choir has to get ready. I'm sorry. I, I need to leave the stage right now. Grandma Gaga, is that you? Well, yes, dearie, it's me. I should have known you'd be in this dream, too, dearie. Well, yeah, right, Grandma Gaga. What, well, what are we supposed to be doing, anyway? Why, why, we don't even have scripts. Don't need a script. You'll know what to say when the time comes, Angela. Well, if you say so, Pop. Hey, nice hair, Lilith. Wait, what? H how do I know your name? 
Well, it was Mrs. Dalloway's unit in Mesopotamian mythology, I think, Angela. Good good to know. You've been paying attention, so let's get along now. Up, up, up. Here we go. Now move like you're all wise, all knowing. Ancient oracles. Listen to their ethereal voices. Okay, Captain Lightwing, you're up next. Give it that Stanislavski method in three voices. Okay, ready? And action. Listen, my children. Listen well. Allow your eyes to follow the sparkling shards as they float through the control room and are swamped into blackness of space and at last on the planet of Ethereus becoming the forest fairy. Ah, oh, wait. Ethergis, well, where, where are we, Ethergis? Meow, seems like we're drifting through the blackness of space, heading to, heading toward the Thurius with all the forest fairies. Oh, my stars! Yes, exactly, Angela. You must rescue Angelita and reunite her with Shavano. This is your final chance to set right all wrongs. All missteps, all hatred, all prejudice, all fear, and return to Earth with the Aka ethos of love, hope, peace, and forgiveness. Huh. Captain Lightwing, uh, it, it, it's you. Uh, I know we're supposed to rescue Angelita and return her to Shivana, but I'm just not sure I'm up to the job. Trust yourself. Angela, we are here to help. Is truly your time to release all fear and embrace your higher power. We can and will do it together. Our shared universal history, history, is in every grain of sand on every planet ever conceived. You are more powerful than you might imagine, Angela. Trust yourself. Trust the process. Ethergis, we've been here before. The, this time, we will get on Halita back to Creston and reunite her with Shavano. Meow! See, see, and Zirkle, too. My Zirkle? Meow, not your Zirkle, Lizard Zirkle. Pasqual, Esqual, Quien Sabe, and Realidad, no hay diferencia. Angela, Angela, take heed, take listen heed, well, listen well, follow the way of a thirges, follow the way of a thirges, who but a thirges, who but could a thirges, could you, lead this, you, day, this for day, a thirges, for a thirges, dear Angela, is always, is the way, always and, the way. As for a thirges, and as for a thirges, soon, soon, you shall see, you shall see, for the crystalline for the fairies, crystalline fairies await you, await now, you, flee, now, flee, here we are, Right where we, right should, where be. we should be, on the on regenerative, the regenerative side, of the side of the series. Our forest, our forest is right over there, there, just beyond, beyond those pine, pine trees. trees. We just we need just to get, need across, to get this across this river and across and that across eternal that abyss. Huh. Well, that would be easy if, if we all had wings. Don't be silly, Angela. No need for wings on Ethereus. My dear, we have Lord Ethereus and his chief negotiator, Tsubasa, You've heard of them, haven't you? Look! Look! They are flying toward us now. They are just landing. Look! Meow! Claude que see, Angela. They have forgotten, but she knows who they are. Well, hey, Captain Lightwing, why, why, did, why did you have to leave Earth? I thought you were using that quasi-crystal technology to develop a computer game and writing all the music with that quasi-crystalline technology, weren't you? Yeah, well, yes, but we knew the solar tsunami was coming. It had been predicted for many years, so I had to get out here to avoid it. But most people didn't believe it would ever happen. But finally, oh, 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 let us tell it. Let us tell it, Captain Lightwing. We can tell it in dactylic tetrameter. Twas the seventh destruction of Earth on sad day from galactic sound waves, some would say. 
or us worse lally, yet we disagree, for each silicon shard of our soul memory is doomed to recite this sad tale tragically when our loving idea could no longer breathe. Yes, sadly, sadly, Angela, it was human ignorance that caused Earth's demise. Statistics were ambiguous, but in theory, we had perfected the Jericho effect and should have been able to stop the solar wave in its tracks, but too many people ignored the truth. I gathered my crew and escaped just in time. From deep space we watched our sun explode, annihilating, devouring the entire solar system. Oh, Earthlings could have deflected the solar wave with a blast of sound waves of 220 megahertz, the Jericho effect. But the Jericho effect is only as effective as those who employ it. Sadly, earthlings had been so blinded by their own powers to mislead, misinform, mistrust, mistreat each other that they simply, well, to put it bluntly, yes, to put it bluntly, they simply destroyed themselves like the proverbial snake eating its own tail. Sad but true. Hard to believe intelligent people could have been so stupid. You can say that again. Hard to believe intelligent. No need to be so literal, Captain. Oh, of course, sorry, well, perhaps I should show Angela how to find the seventh wormhole for when they make their escape back to Crestone. Oh, oh, it's okay, Thurgis will show the way. Oh, you mean uh, your cat? Of course, I mean my cat, Thurgis. Thurgis is the way. Of course, Captain Lightwing, the way of Ithurgis is the way. The way of Ithurgis is always the way. The way of Ithurgis knows nothing of time. Through the way of Ithurgis, the way she shall find. Are we still talking about the seventh wormhole? Yes, of course, Captain, but since we are simply bits and pieces of words, thoughts, and fleeting awarenesses, you may have some difficulty understanding our shattered crystalline voices. Oh, not the problem, not the problem. I began speaking in three voices myself after traveling at warp speed through the seventh wormhole. Well, well, my, well, now I know. Oh. Well, now I know I must be dreaming. Here, Angela, take one of these shards of broken orb. You can feel it trying to communicate through shifting static or a slight softening to near gel. Yes, you can feel it now. It will begin to emit a high, unbearable dying cat howl for a second or two, but just go with it. Then you'll hear some words or phrases. God. Horror, war, okay. pandemic, war, killing, hatred, lies, terrorism, crazies, lust, greed, power. Oh, it's all your fault. It's all your fault. It's not true. It's fake news. Oh, God, stop. Would you stop? Stop, stop, please. I can't stand it. Well, these horrors went on for years, Angela. They should have been warnings enough for anyone paying attention, but their things were not. Well, they were not awake, but some of course were, and they, they tried to save the planet from destruction, but there, there were simply not enough voices of reason, so the critical mass moved inextricably toward annihilation. Optimism was futile. We prayed that we could have managed to save ourselves, find a beacon among the ruins of the last destruction, but sadly, our efforts were too little, too late. Survival itself is at stake, Angela. 
Do you not realize that? Huh. Yeah, I think I, I'm finally beginning to realize that we are the ones we've been waiting for. How should we proceed then? First, we must take care not to land on the east side of the River of Love. Well, why not? Centuries ago, the River of Love carved a deep canyon, the eternal abyss, and well, of course, usually there's a bridge across to the west side, but well, sorry to say, the bridge washed out last winter, and we could not rebuild it. I think that's rather inept of you, I'd say. Well, don't be so judgy, Captain. <sighs> we're good at a lot of things, but we're just crystal and shards, you know, not even whole crystals. And also, sometimes the folks living on the east side of the river connect don't like to connect with us if you know what we mean, so to speak. So a lot of things just don't get done. Sounds like lack of communication, crystalline shards. We have that on Earth, too. Meow. That's a bit judgy, Angela. Zip it, Athurgis. Can, can we just get on with this? Meow. Rhetorical question, Angela. Back off, cat. Let's just go build us a bridge. That's the spirit, Angela. Let's go. Let's go build a bridge. Let's go. Ikimashou. Meow, Angela. Ikimashou. Let's go. Ikimashou. Let's go. Well, now I know who I am. And I am ready to go build this bridge. Come on, Athurgis. Warp time through all these dreams and red threads of gravity and love may be historically discombobulating, but... I am up for it. Aiki Masho, let's go. Aiki Masho, let's go. Listeners, I can't wait for the next episode. Let's keep trying to sort out all these wild dreams from reality. This is Billy Ruth Hopkins for Ruichi with KCIW 100.7 on your FM dial, right here in beautiful downtown Brookings, where every day is an awesome day. And we can always choose to say yes. Life is indeed very, very good. Remember to catch us on podcast at kciw.org forward slash Angelita's Wings. That's A-N-G-E-L-I-T-A-S dash wings. Until next time.